Welcome to a cheap bicycle lock that I found on the street when we were on vacation. I was waiting outside a euro shop for my family to return when this, um, this lock caught my attention. It was just hanging around in the uh, open state, so it was not locked up and it was asking me to take it along and to pick it. And so I did, at least I tried to pick it open just the way it was but um, it felt strange and I felt <laughs> like being a noob not being able to pick this lock open. I could set some pins but then suddenly the feedback stopped and I was not able to get any more pins to bind or I thought they were already in the picked state and so I was um, not wasting but investing, investing a lot of time in trying to pick this lock open without success. Finally um, I applied more tension to the plug and I got more pins to bind and then it stopped again and I was thinking maybe this lock is not functioning correct anymore but then I felt a little, a little give on the plug when I applied a lot of uh, tension uh, to the plug and then I took a screwdriver and I had a really hard time to, to turn it open. So the lock was actually pick, picked but I wasn't able to turn the plug open just with a tension wrench. That it was the, the whole story actually. Whenever you come across an unknown lock and it feels strange, so the pins, they pins, they felt really light and easy to uh, to pick up and, and they returned also easily. But then there was a, a point where the plug would not turn normally again into uh, the open uh, position and uh, you had, had to use a lot of force to get it open. Yeah, then <laughs> I sprayed WD-40 in the lock and now it opens like a charm. That's what I want to show you. I uh, used this L tensioner to tension the plug on the top, on the pin side, and I used this almost broken pick and it has enough life in it, enough strength in it to uh, pick this lock open. So let's give it a try. Usually pin 1 is binding first. Let's see if this does. Yeah, pin 1 is set. Two, three, I think it's a four pin now. That was four, I believe. It's not that easy with this broken pick. So now three, I believe, was set. Not yet open. Three again, dropped. I think it has these um, cheap Chinese uh, pins that look like uh, cut off pieces from wire. They sometimes behave like little spools. Now I think two is binding and got it open. So that's how easy it is and you can see how little force is required to pick this lock open with this already completely broken pick. Yeah, a lot of fun actually to tinker around, to play around with this lock with different pick and tension wrench combinations. But um, yeah, the takeaway is um, use WD-40 on unknown locks or any other, other type of lubricant or uh, choose to um, get it uh, free so that you have uh, fun picking it. So uh, that was the first souvenir, by the way. I have another souvenir here. Um, this combination lock, and it has an very interesting story to it, but this will be subject of another video. Alright, thanks for watching, happy picking and bye bye!